Deze punt gaat gebruik van zachter, want hier een jongens te gaan. Ze gebruik ook al steeds verkneemd in deze dagen. Aantal deze keer mag de andere niet al bescheiden, maar omdat de boksen naar de vingers en de larges zijn, de reflinten misschien soms van hart en liefste met haar, want dat leuren ze mee. Wat bij zwarte Willink, de sponsor. Interessant, dames en heren, wij zijn van de toekomst maken we om achter in de lift te gaan aan de eerste volgende. And we are back after our break with the chapter number eight. These are the recently approved stallions. That's why we are lowering the music a little bit, making sure they have a good experience. You can find chapter 8 at page 140 of your catalog. And we are looking at catalog number 536. Elger, A. Seven years old, bred by the family Bauma. And in ownership at Age Okkema. Elger is sired by Nana492, coming from a preferent crustacean mare out of Olaf315. Elger presented himself excellent in harness. Voor van Elver, sterk bij een prestatie en een duurzame vruchtbaarheid die 19 jaar is, 11 vrouwens op de wereld zetten 
An elder stood out in the central inspection with his long lines and racial type, a very impressive stallion with a lot of feathers and very high scores under the saddle. Eight for the walk, eight and a half for the canter. And of course, with his spacious walk and powerful canter, this very friendly stallion is going to exceed in riding and show driving. Seven years old, Elther 536. You can find more information about this recently approved stallion at page 140 of your catalog. And showing himself to the judges in the arena is Jeppe 537, five years old and a triple A status. Bred by the family Lopers and in ownership of Stuterij Bommelstein. His father is Alwin 469, coming from a star prestige mare out of Minze 384. He was the top tier of his year with that triple A status at all three disciplines. Total scores going almost up to 90 and even over in driving. He scored a 9 for his trot and he is rewarded with his excellent use of the hind leg. He is easy in the work with a beautiful trot with a lot of suspension and bend in the hind leg. He has a lot of front and a very easy to collect and extend in the body. It's a curious stallion, very awake, honest and willing to work. And this young Jeppe 537 is at stud at the Nieuwe Heuvel.
Engine-trimmer Tim Alvey with the Yoings in the van. Back car, Tempo A. Yep, but back 3, 7. Gaat hij nog weer? Anders, dan zien we weer straks de hengsten op tal worden gezet. Dan de de volgorde. Staan allemaal opgesteld van de vaste motors en naar de rollen. And when the horses come back, they will be placed in order. And we will invite the breeders and owners in the arena to honor them. in Brander. We are looking at Nick 538, just four years old and already acquired triple A status. Nick is sired by Tide 501, coming from a Bartele 472 mare. He's one of the first sons out of Tide 501 that got approved. He's coming from a very secure line 5 with a model sport double A mom. A lot of racial type for this horse and very upward built. Intelligent horse, likes attention and loves to do his work. He's still a bit youthful, but he still is very good at his job already at his age.
Dan een soort Ruud uh, Sponsor. En dan rechts de tussenwinnen. Rechts de Martinez Dijk 3 9. Trippel aan. Vier jaar. Van de zijgenaar de familie Notenboom Scholten in Wegelings Oort. Midden naar de Eppingaan Oude Meggen. Waar is ze? Two, we are looking at Martinez 539. Zou je het bij Tide 501 coming from a mare from Sipke 450. Bred and owned by the family Noteboom Scholten. En in breeding at the Stad Gaasterland. And together with Nick, Martinez is the one of the first sons out of Tide 501 that got approved. And from mother's father we have Sipke. And this young stallion, Martinez is a perfect example of an all-round Frisian horse. He scored sevens and higher for all exercises in the central inspection. And he is showing a lot of natural balance and use of the body. He has a good ability to collect and extend and he has a very active use of the hind leg. He's uh, very much in the racial type and sturdy build with three good gates. We komen aan de lijn van Robby, de vier die één aan Serpje en de lijn van Eens, Jasper, drie, zes, zes. And we are currently looking at Murk 540 Triple A Stallion, only four years old. Bred and owned by the family van Kempen and De Boer. Murk is sired by Teun 505, coming from a mother out of Lodewijk. Murk heeft een sterke en actieve achterweek, laat een mooi ruimte worden in de markt zien. Dan vond ik aan de rechts, dat kunnen we zelf ook vaststellen. Dus een en Murk 540 is one of the first approved sons out of Teun 505. 
and he excelled in the central inspection. 83.5 was his high score under the saddle and in the driving test. His mother is a crown double A mare with a very high IBOP score of 80 points. He is very light-footed in the trot and a good ability to collect and extend. He's got a strong and very active hind leg and a very sp spacious movement in the front legs. And remarkable for this young stallion is his very noble head. Very luxurious and finely built, gives him a very youthful appearance. He's very kind to the people and very well behaved in the stable, but in the work he is very sensible and eager. He likes to do his best and has a lot of willingness to please his owners. Mulk 540 is available for breeding at stall van de Kadik. And these young stallions just got approved a few months ago. We're looking at the presentation of the stallion Mono 541. Four years old, bred and owned by the family Faber and De Vries. Sired by Funger 478, coming from a preferent mare from Andries 415. And Mano 541 is the first approved stallion out of Funger. His mother is the star preferent daughter out of Andris 415. A strong, strong and sturdy built stallion with a very strong top line and wide strong loins. His legs are very clean. And this horse also excelled exceeded as a very all-round horse to use in every discipline. Friendly horse, a nice character, not easily impressed, a lot of go and a lot of willingness to work. Mono 541 is available for stud at stable the Kadaik.
De komst van de Menzo bij 4 2 Triple A op de Viaje Kaal Persens. Op bij Sal Jede Vlemmer. En maar samen met Charlie de Boer, Sint Johannes Schaar. Menzo, Jordan Lokan bij Club 2. Voor de Royal Spark de Statie Manny van Lees. Charlie 4 bij 4. Dan sterk de vent van Jasper 366. Voor vader Oudman is Benzo de derde voetgeurde zoon. Hij komt Benzo uit stand 50. Voor de is Juliel H. van de Kepijnen, Nobel Sport, de Statie de A. Voor de Leibol Sport. Voor de OZT, als je nu zegt, zet men met kampioen van Pennies voor de Zees. En we are looking at Menso 542. 4-year-old, bred and owned by Stal Jeden en T. de Boer. Sired by Ulbrim 502, coming from the Sport Prestation, double A mare out of Challa 454. The third approved son from Ulbrim 502, this one. And he's coming from Stam 50 with Mother Jubiel H. van Lutkepenjum. It's a mother line full of sport. Um, the mother is scoring very high in dressage and also in driving. She became champion of the breeding mares in front of the Frisian chase. And a half-sister of this stallion, Crystal Jade, is also a famous horse, became reserve champion in the Frisian Talent Cup. And that might be the reason that this stallion scored a triple A, 88.5 points under the saddle. And most remarkable there are his trot and his canter. This horse has a talent for natural balance and use of the body. His ability to collect and extend is there with a very active hind leg and a beautiful use of the front leg. A youthful stallion with a noble head and very fine but dry leg work. He's polite and friendly. He's slightly insecure with new situations, but it's a very nice horse to work with. And this horse is for stud at stall van de Kadik.
Lance in danger rugby. We're going to the last stallion in this chapter. Last Lance, back via B, double A, B A, Pop B, M A B, Slavers, Kermedek in the fourth. En bij Lea van Maan en Esten, Zoman Teun, Mijk 05, Moeders, Stef Referent van Norbert 444. We are looking at Mans 543. Four year old, bred by the family Slagers, Carnebeek, and in ownership of the family van Manen. That's also where he is at stud. Sired by Tone 505 out of a Norbert 444 mare. He's the second son from Tone 505. And he is coming from the very strong breeding mare line Van de Gonda. This is the mare line 13. And his mother is star preferent and very sustainable. And also his 19-year-old grandmother is still remarkably fit. This is a long-lined and upward-built stallion with a very strong top line. He's very youthful, friendly and very eager to please the people around him. He's very curious and easy to work with in all disciplines. And the power of this horse is in the driving where he scored highest. Months, four, five, four, three. Only four years old, this stallion. And all the young stallions are coming back. The judges are going to place them in order of their performance. And that has nothing to say about their breeding quality. Because 
because you have to see this in the bigger picture. If you have a mare and you like to breed with this mare, make sure you choose a stallion that fits the breeding goals of the Frisian horse and also your own breeding goals. Martinus, als hij weer mee kan opkomen. Martinus heeft de vorige elfer. Yeah. Changing the order. According to the opinion of the Burke judges. Evan starts after Jeppe by 3-7. Dus Burke na Jeppe. Burke is going behind Jeppe. Mannen om aan deze kant even op komen. Mano has to come this way. En wacht even ze achter zijn zeven beetje aansluiten. Een mans van het plaatsje op. Mans. Can move up one more place. Hij is er aan één van de hand houden, dus niet één van aansluiten. De Frans die je net eens, die mag wel even doorlopen. Even wat er daar vooraan. Even wat er daar vooraan. Even wat er daar vooraan. Dames en heren, jongens, 
Ladies and gentlemen, the young stallions. Yep, a five three seven in the front. Second, Martinez. Elger Bergrises. And then Elger. And we are inviting the breeders and owners in to honor these stallions who just recently got approved. And we're going to give word to Sabine Zwaga. High quality in this chapter. And these horses have presented themselves very well. And the decision was made on the walk for these horses. Jeppe 537 in the front. High on the legs. Upwardly built. And a beautiful front. Very supple in the gates. And a lot of balance and suppleness. A well-deserved first place for Jeppe 537. But very close behind him we had Martinez 539, strongly built. A very good top line and group. A nice and spacious walk and a very good rhythm in the trots. Martinez 539. Third place, Elger 536. Very elegant horse. Long lined with an excellent walk and a good self-carriage in the trot. Then we go to Murk. This horse has such a beautiful head. Good top line and very modern horse, this one. Very light-footed in the trot. Then we have Nick. Nick 538, a beautiful eye, very good in the racial type, and a very good hind leg in the trot. Then we go to Mans 543. Nice, we're uphill built. A very good technique in the trot. And then we go to Menso 542. Very youthful stallion. And he was already dancing in the walk and he was very light footed in the trot. And he showed some excellent steps between his excitement. And then last but not least, Mano 541. Very strong in the loins. 
with a good walk and a lot of bend in the hind legs in the trots. And then we go, which stallions are we taking with us? Of course, Jeppe will come. And we also like to see Martinez one more time. And we're also going to take a number three Elger. And the stallion Mons is going to change owner. He is going to travel to Mexico. And the new owners of this horse are also here, the family Sanchez. And we're going to enjoy these horses one more time in a lap of honor. Yep, 537, Martinez 539, and Elger 536.